Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll talk about how to trick your mind to start getting into cold shower. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more of this type of videos, there will be links in the description box below. So before you start taking cold shower or anything new, please consult your doctor or a medical professional. Uh, this is not for everyone. And today I'll talk about how I, start, how I started taking cold shower. So the thing is, if you're jumping into a cold shower right away, it is very difficult. So for example, the way my um, water system works that this is the hot section and this is the very cold and this is kind of mixed. So when this lever is right here in this level, then this is like, you know, the mixed water, which is a combination of hot and uh, cold and it's the comfort level and it feels very good, like, you know, uh, starting taking shower here uh, what I do right now I got used to taking cold shower so I put this lever like here which is kind of the maximum level and uh, this is like a very ice cold water but uh, the trick I do that uh, you know I do not start taking cold shower right away uh, so that's what I'm going to show you today and uh, there's going to be a bit water noise and uh, you know you it which might interfere my voice so sorry about that but uh, I don't have any way to stop that so what happens let's start the tap here so this is very hot and this is the comfort level which is a combination of hot and cold and this is very cold water so right here the very cold water. So what I do when I start, you know, the tap, I put it right here. And this water, uh, when it's right here, you know, that's how usually most people uh, take shower and that, you know, it doesn't feel very un uncomfortable. The reason uh, it's very difficult to take cold shower because it's taking you, you know, uh, beyond your comfort zone and it's not something you're used to so definitely you don't want to take cold shower and uh, you're going to feel like you know very uncomfortable or bad for the first week I would say but after that you kind of get used to it and right now actually I'm looking forward to taking cold shower every day because I got used to it and uh, the benefits uh, and the feeling the like you know freshness you feel after taking a cold shower is very different than taking like in a hot shower you can feel that something is happening and you can feel more awake and more like you know uh, refreshing and you feel more like you know uh, you want to do more job or it do, does lots of things to your body and I can even feel it after like you know taking cold shower for one month so start with your regular temperature uh, shower uh, which is going to be the mix uh, or comfort zone somewhere here and then gradually come to the cold level but you know don't go to very cold right away so what you can do you can just like you know let's say go like here and then here and then here i didn't go to the top cold level for the first couple of weeks so when i started taking cold shower i was doing like uh, up to here which is good cold and then once i got used to it now i'm at the full cold level and i'm comfortable with taking full cold shower and you know uh, it doesn't bother me anymore because i already surpassed uh, my mind or my body's comfort zone because my mind got used to it so you know it doesn't uh, make feel any difference and even if I want to go back to hot shower right now, I cannot do it anymore because I got used to cold shower and I'm looking forward to it every day and uh, the benefits and the like, you know, what you feel uh, in your body. I had before like, you know, a little bit pain after sleeping, but those things are gone. I, the, the benefits are right there and you can even feel it when you start taking cold shower uh, or when you take cold shower for one month, which I'm seeing it right now. But the trick is to start with your regular temperature. And this is not just like, you know, when you got used to it. Even now, I got used to it. I'm not going to start cold shower right away. So first, I'm going to start here, uh, which is the like, you know, comfort level. And then gradually, I decline to totally cold. And then I, the last couple of minutes of my shower is like an extreme cold, which is like ice cold. And then I end my shower. So start with like, you know, a regular uh, comfort level, uh, putting soap 
or most of the stuff or shampooing kind of somewhere like here and then before you end the shower just run it to the top cold level for a couple of minutes and I, and I think that would give the benefit to your body which you'll feel right away once you uh, come out of a cold shower so this level to tell you the truth it's not going to be like uh, very uh, comfortable you're going to feel the cold but it still is tolerable you're not going to feel too bad and i feel like this oh, 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 oh. But you know, it's only for two minutes and that does kind of like a miracle to my body and I've been experiencing uh, that right now. So that's how I trick my mind to taking cold shower and then how I take cold shower every day. Thank you for watching this video. There'll be more videos coming up. So I'll see you shortly. Thank you.